Hello all, welcome to CTPS Education. In this video, let's see about the interview questions and answers for final keyword. We have already uploaded interview questions for static keyword. I will include the link in description box. Please watch that. Let's get started. What is final keyword? Final means something that cannot be changed. In Java, it means it is a modifier and it is used to make the values unchanged. Example we can take passport number, aadhar card number, this thing we can make it as final and so it cannot be changed. Where we can apply this final means to variables, methods and class. If we apply the final keyword to variable means then it cannot be changed once assigned. If we apply that to method means then that is final method. This final method cannot be overridden. If it is applied to class then that is final class. This class cannot be inherited that is it cannot be extended. Some of the available final classes are string, integer and other wrapper classes. Difference between static variable and final variable. Static variable means it is class level variable and it is common for all the objects. Whereas final variable means a variable which cannot be changed. Let's see some more differences. A variable is made as static if it is common for all the objects. Whereas final variable, a variable is made as final if it should remain unchanged. This static variable can be changed after assigned, whereas final variable we cannot change once assigned. Static variable can be applied to variables, methods, blocks and nested classes. Here final variable can be applied to variables, method, class. What is blank final variable? If you are not initializing the final variable, then that is blank final variable. Can we leave this without initializing? No, it should be initialized before usage. Ok, how can we do that? So how to initialize this final variable means it can be initialized at the time of declaration through instance block, through static block or through constructor. Can final method be overloaded? B no, if you make a method as final then it cannot be overridden but it can be overloaded. So yes, same method name with the different arguments are allowed for final methods. Can we make a static method as final? Yes, we can do that. If it is made final, then instead of method overriding here, method hiding will not be possible since it is static method. Can main method be declared as final? We know main method is also a static method. So it is it should be possible. Yes, if it is made final, then here also method hiding will not be possible since it is static method. Can we declare constructor as final? Since the constructor is already not inherited, there is no use to have final constructor. Can we make the local variable as final? Yes. In fact, final is the only modifier which can be applied to local variable. Can we create object for final class? Final class means it cannot be extended, but we can create object for that. Can abstract method be final? For this, first we need to know what is abstract method. It is method without implementation. That is, there will not be any body for this method, only declaration will be there. And to use this abstract method, we need to override but final method means it cannot be overridden right so it is not possible to make abstract method as final as final methods cannot be overridden can interface be final it is also similar to the abstract method only here also we cannot do as to use interface it should be implemented in subclass what is static final variable static means a class level variable final means it cannot be changed if we apply that together, then it becomes constant. That is only one copy of variable exists, which cannot be changed by any instance. How we can create this constant means public static final variable name equal to value. Can we change the state of object to which a final variable is pointing? Yes, we can change the state of object referred by a final variable, but it cannot be reassigned. Example, array list hash map. We can add, update or remove elements from this final array list, but it cannot be pointed to another collection. Let's understand this more with the help of example. Final list integer list equal to new array list. Here we have taken one list and to this list we have added some values called 1 and 2 and we have created one more list called TMP list. And in this list we are storing the previously created list. So now if you see here we are just storing the value of previously created one so this is possible but list equal to tmp list 
if we do like this here we are trying to reassign the previously created list to another variable called tmp list this is not possible as we are trying to reassign to another variable to understand all the concepts we have seen so far let's see the key points to remember final variables cannot be changed or reassigned final method cannot be overridden final class cannot be inherited final variable must be initialized before usage object can be created for final class final and static can be applied together constructor abstract class and interface cannot be final